uh, my expect I didn't quite know what to expect. I also had to write, like many others, had to write something, and I wrote like my ideal situation. But I wasn't expecting that we were actually going to do that. And much to my surprise, this was actually very embedded in what we we're going to do. And also, I found it very nice that what we were doing was actually making an impact in the real world. So it wasn't like other interns program I know where you are doing very boring work and it seems like taking forever. It really felt that we were taken seriously and that we actually contributed something to knowledge production and also in this in the society and with the youth organization. So that's what I really really liked and I hadn't expected beforehand. When it turned out like uh, during the summer I the expectations were kind of fulfilled because we worked as a team in designing like many learning activities. We also tested them, we visited uh, youth media organizations. So for me it was like uh, an excellent kind of experience of matching expectations and realize, realizing them during the summer. It was great. So I was going in kind of expecting to kind of one, work individually, and um, two, maybe plum, um, go into like personal uh, details, maybe um, more emotional. And I wasn't expecting to like work this collaboratively or actually like make an impact in, um, to like communities, to youth. Um, I was very surprised when we brought this lit review entitled Information Quality. I was like, what's information quality? But now, now, now we, um, we developed all these curriculum modules and I was really, um, I was really surprised just that we got to go to Roxbury, we got to go to Brooklyn. Um, all, all 11 of us, I think it's 11, right? Um, we went to actually teach this curriculum in schools and it was an excellent experience, like just going beyond my personal boundaries and um, seeing other people and like, it was world expanding. So I think one of the biggest challenges that I faced coming into um, this summer was that I come from an environment, so I'm still in college, where everything is very structured. And, you know, you get your assignment, there's a very specific question that you're trying to answer or a goal that you're trying to achieve. And so I'm used to working kind of uh, with a very straightforward rubric and very clear expectations of what you're going to be doing. And so I think it definitely took some getting used to to kind of know how to best utilize my freedom and independence and to kind of take advantage of all of that and still get to where I wanted to be at the end of it um, and the kind of product I wanted. So I think, I don't know, that was definitely the biggest challenge and hopefully something that I overcame a little bit this summer. So I, I didn't really know at first uh, what to expect when I came to the uh, Youth and Media Lab, partly because uh, I, I came much later than everybody else since I had to finish up my uh, uh, sophomore year at school so I, I didn't know how easy it would be and at first when I came I even though I had met Sandra and Nathaniel a moment before I I hadn't mess, met the rest of the team and exactly what I was supposed to be working on so the first day I came I noticed like everyone was doing their work and I I felt kind of lost like what am I gonna uh, what should I be working on and things like that but then eventually I think what I realized was that since it was very much team oriented, uh, it was actually very easy to get back into get back in routine. And I was like, whoa, okay, I, I don't know what, what will it be like. And right now, I, I have to say, well, it worked awesome. I mean, it was really it was really fun doing all the work, also hanging out with people, and. I think I've never worked that hard before, I mean, like, so focused on something, but also had, I never had, like, that much fun working on stuff like this. What made me really excited about the lab was that kind of looking at other stuff that had been created by other organizations, particularly MIT, looking at what their um, lab focused on youth and technology have grown into over the years. I mean, just an incredible thing. It's this global network that they've created. And I saw something, kind of a vision, like a really far down the road vision of what like the Youth and Media Lab could be. And when I came in, I felt like I was able to put like um, at least a little bit of myself into it and working with everyone. And I feel like we all were able to kind of shape a little bit of 
what we all thought like the lab could become. Because we wouldn't be here if we didn't think that this could be something significant. I really recommend like for future interns that um, they they are not shy. This is something that uh, Amar, one of the people, the, the staff members in the core team told me. Don't be shy and try to go to all the events that the Bergman Center is doing. Because actually it's a great hub. Like the network that the center has is amazing and you can meet like like very great researchers, professors, uh, entrepreneurs. So I, I really enjoyed meeting a lot of people during this summer and like making a lot of connections for future projects.